So you turn on your calculator and it's on already. Uh, you press menu setup and this one, this calculator is mode setup, but you want to go in your mode and you're searching for equation. Um, this one is down here, so I'll press enter and that I could have just pressed E to select it as well. And here they are telling me to pick between simultaneous equations or polynomials. This calculator can do both. Let's see what happens when I press mode here. Oh, I was already on it. So like, normally it starts off on computation mode. So when I, um, I press mode, I look for equation. There I'm seeing five for equation. And the first two are simultaneous equations. This one has two variables. This one has three variables. You see the Z there. And here we have the quadratic AX squared plus BX plus C. So you could just press three to get quadratic here. And now you put in the coefficients of the quadratic to solve. So here you select polynomial first. Then you select what degree of the polynomial you want. That's two. And you have your quadratic up there. Let's say the quadratic was what? Two x squared plus five x. I'm just putting in the coefficients. This is negative, negative 12. Now, every time I want to put it in, I'm pressing equal as like enter. And when I press enter for the final time, boom, there I have x1 is 3 over 2, x2 is negative 4, and what's even more useful is that it goes on to give me the minimum, the coordinates of the minimum point. So you can use this to complete the square negative 5, and 5 over 4, and the y coordinate is negative 121 over 8. And if I press enter again, it'll take me back there. You can also use this these values to factorize. Say you have 3 over 2. That means the factor is 2x minus 3. And the next factor will say this is negative 4. The next factor will be x plus 4. You just change the sign and invert. So factorizing on your calculator, factorizing quadratics on your calculator is possible. It's pretty simple actually. Most calculators can do this, but these two calculators are the easiest to get it done in my opinion so the display on this calculator is superior to the display on this one um, but this one can still put down the work there we have the x1 the x2 and the minimum right so this is this is just like the big brother or big sister to this you know this is the one i've been using throughout the exam period and really hold down the fort for us a lot of students bought this calculator and because of this were able to do matrices vectors equations statistics complex numbers convert bases this can do the same thing as well with better better display you can also do fractions um uh, what's that integration everything everything if you live in Trinidad, you can get them delivered to you, Gordon Technologies, at a convenient location, or you can order online if you are li not living in Trinidad. Definitely, you would want to invest in a proper calculator when you're doing exams. Makes your life easier, makes everything run smoother. Don't forget to press like, as Zion is screaming in the background there. Don't forget to press subscribe if you haven't already. Some very good stuff on this channel for students.